Hey you guys, I just ate some ribs. So if you see anything on my face, that's why. This is my reaction to the 32 bars video with Savannah Hannah. So I went there to support her, you know, because I'm I'm not a hater. I'm not the type to like throw shade for no reason or like just be annoying and a hater aid type person, right? I'm not like that. I'm going to go there and go to you and give you your props and be on my way. Because everyone, everyone just needs love sometimes. And you never know what someone's going through. So I went to go do that, right? I even have a picture on TikTok showing that I met the girl. We didn't have beef. We never had beef. I didn't even know her that much for real for us to even have beef. So... The fact that when I look at the video, she has these weird things drawn on my face at a certain point, and it's like weird, and I don't know what's going on. I don't know what's going on with her, but I know that God's going to take care of it. I plead about Jesus over it. I don't know if she has any beef with me because she knows my calling, or she knows that I could be, I mean... There's no competition because I already won. But you know what I mean. I am an artist. I have good music. I'm very talented. So maybe she is somewhat intimidated by me. But there's no reason for you to throw subs in your new video for any reason. Like, there's no reason. Especially if... I was in your face. You have the whole time to say, oh, I don't like you or I, I would rather you not be in the video. If you don't like me, let me go home. I had things to do anyways. I had just passed the state test that day. So I could have easily just went home to go celebrate with my family that actually does give a fuck about me. And I actually have a family. RIP to your mother, but my mother's still alive by the grace of Jesus Christ. So you didn't have to throw shade like that. If you want to throw shade, don't talk to me in any type of way. That's 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 what I'm trying to say. Just don't try to sit there and make it look like we have beef when we never had beef. The whole time I was in your face, you were nice to me. You were smiling. You were being nice to me. Like, I don't understand where this all came from. In the DMs, you were nice to me. The whole time, you were nice, 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 nice. Now, all of a sudden, I look at the video and there's a bunch of drawings over my face during the part where you say rappers, like you're trying to throw a subliminal sub. Like, ma'am, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> like, I don't give a fuck. Like, you can throw all the subs you want. I'm still going to win. I'm still going to win. But you know what gets these girls pissed off? You know what gets them pissed off? I have less than them. I have less less resources, less everything than them. And I still get more done. I still get more impact. And that's what they don't like about me. That's what they don't like about me. <laughs> that's what they really don't like about me. Because they try everything in their power to cut off my resources, to try to, like, steal whatever... I I got going on. It doesn't work because it's never going to be the same because what's for me is for me, right? They try to do all that. It still doesn't work. I do what I'm doing. It pop up. It pops off more. I get more notoriety. Everything works out. And then they're like, how is she doing this? How is she doing this? How is she still standing? How is she still? How is she still? It's the grace of God, my friend. It's Jesus Christ. And I really don't understand why people have to sit there and try to compete with me. First of all, I'm not competing with nobody. I'm just trying to better myself. I'm just trying to better myself. All of those things that you say in your videos are things that I've said before. I don't know if you did voodoo to try to, like, make it look like it was you. 
It's never, it's never been you. And you know the truth too. Even when I was in front of you and you were talking to your girlfriend, you thought I didn't hear you. I peep everything. You said to her, oh, we do voodoo on her. Ha 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 ha. You thought I didn't hear that? I heard you. It's okay though, because when I get my time, I want you to keep the same energy. Not the fake energy you were giving me in front of me trying to pretend like you were my friend and being nice. No. Keep that same energy. Because you were just in my face trying to play like you were my friend. You were just being nice to me. Like. These people are so fake. It really makes me disgusted. And you're the main one talking about being friendly. And you know what a friend is to me. You don't even know what to you don't you don't even know what a friend is for real. You don't even know how to be a friend because if you did, you would have never did that to me in that video. But it's okay though. It's okay though. This is going to make me work harder now. Now I'm going to release music and you're gonna be upset because what you're trying to do is what I actually do what you're trying to do is what I actually do what God called me to do that's what you're attempting to do but you're not succeeding and don't think because you have clout you're fulfilling the purpose. No. What's mine is mine. What's yours is yours. You can be inspired. That's good. You can have inspiration. But at least give them credit where it's due. Say, you know what, girl? I see you. Do your thing. Which is technically what you said in my face. Right? You said that to my face. But on the internet, you want to act like it's Twitter fingers. That's crazy to me because you were literally in my face talking about you go girl and you, you, it's your time to shine and all this stuff. Why couldn't you say that on the video? Hmm. Why couldn't you say that on the video? Hmm. Why couldn't you put a little crown over my head too? You're shady. You're shady. And it's okay. It's okay. I understand you're jealous. I don't blame you. I don't blame you. But God is good. God is good and he's always going to protect me. He's always going to make sure I'm good. So I'm going to release my music. I'm going to release my music and I'm going to make sure I'm the queen of New York. And Nikki, if you see this, you know what you're doing. You're not stupid. You could have chose the right one, but you chose the wrong one. I'm the right one. I'm the one, the actual one. These other bitches are just clones. They're just wannabes. So I'm going to keep working, working, focusing on me. And eventually you're going to see the glow up and you're going to regret treating me like that. You're going to regret it. And even if you don't regret it, I really don't care. I'm just going to be happy that I'm at a different place in my life. And even now, like, I'm not fully where I want to be, but I'm grateful for where I'm at. I'm very, very grateful for where I'm at. So I just want to thank God for that. And um, that's about it. That is my response on 
the Savannah Hannah 32 bars video. Summary to sum it all up. I did not think she was going to do that. She was pretending to be nice in my face. She was pretending to be some positive person in my face. But of course, obviously, because she's jealous, she wanted to throw subs in the video. I don't really care. Like, I really don't care. The more people talk about me, the more I get paid. Because I'm going to post reactions on my YouTube and just get checks off of it. How about that? <laughs> How about that? Like, I don't really care. But, um, thank you for watching and God bless. Um, I probably will end up seeing all these people in the future when I start making success with my music and then by that time when they want to invite me to their little vip parties and stuff like that when they actually want to invite me for real for real, there's different types of invites there's like the rsvps and stuff like that and i get invited sometimes but when they actually send out invites where it's specifically for me that's when i won't even want to come because it's like by the time i get to that level I'm going to be so disgusted by all y'all. It's going to be like, why should I even come to, to party with you? Like, why should I? After all the nonsense you tried to put me through, you think I'm going to sit there and still come to the party? Nah, I'd rather sit in my house and pray and, and work up and stack up and call it a day. I don't give a fuck about this shit no more. It's all about the mission. And I'm going to complete my mission in Jesus Christ's name. Amen and amen.